that was part of my plan. And then when I made my plan, I had to have a backup plan and a backup plan. Because in case I didn't make it to the NBA or I didn't get that opportunity to go to this school, I had to have a backup plan. And so the thing I'll say to you guys is, is plan your work and then work your plan. Because you gotta make sure that when you plan your work, you make realistic goals. You should make short-term goals. Things you want to accomplish in the next two months. Things you want to accomplish this summer. Things you want to accomplish next school year. Because the most important thing is, the only thing that you can control is how you prepare. When you have a test, you know, some people are like, hey, I'm gonna start studying the night before the test. That's not a great way to prepare. The best way to prepare for a test is start studying days and weeks in advance. And so the thing that I, I just want to make sure I said to you guys is prepare. That's the most important thing that you ever know is that you can control that. And then once you prepare, just go in and give it your best and let your time fall. Because you got to have a plan, you got to implement that plan, and then you got to have a backup plan. Next thing I'm going to say, anybody have any questions for me? Question right there. What is that? Stand up, stand up. What college did I go to? I went to the University of the Pacific. It's a small school in California, right outside of Oakland. I grew up in the Oakland area. That's where I'm In the back. When did I play for the Warriors? I'm going to tell you this story how I played for the Warriors. I want you guys to listen to this. This, this, this is a quick story. When I was in college, I used to go run on this track at this local community college. When I came off the track one day, this man came up to me. And he said, hey, can you play basketball? And I said, yeah, I can play. He said, come on, get your shoes, hurry up. So I got my shoes, I went to the gym, and all the players on the Warriors were in there playing. They needed one more player. It was the first effort, this was many years ago. It was years ago that they told me to go to the court, and I just played with the players on the team. I actually played very good that day, but I was still in college. So after I was finished, the coach came up to me, and he said, hey, man, what's your name? And I told him my name. My name is Dell Demps. And he said, well, hey, I want to stay in contact with you. So for the next couple of years, I used to just work out with the Warriors while I was still in, in, in college. But the whole key was that day that I went there to play with them, if I wouldn't have been prepared, if I had just went on the track, I just shot like a 1,000 jump shots, and if I would have played bad, they wouldn't have invited me back. But because they invited me back, a couple of years later, they signed me to a contract. And that coach that came out to the court that day, you guys might have heard of him, some of you guys, his name was Greg Popovich. You guys know who Greg Popovich is? At the time, he was an assistant coach. And so, when I played for the Warriors, he left to go to San Antonio, he took me with him. And then after I stopped playing, I worked for him for five years. And so, it just all started that I was prepared. Because one of the hardest things in life to get is the opportunity. But when that opportunity presents itself, you have to be prepared. Question. He said, where did I go to school? I went to school in Oakland. I grew up in California. I am six foot four. Did I ever play for the Pelicans? No, when I played, there were no Pelicans. They were the Hornets back then. Did I play against Michael Jordan? Yes. He tried to dunk on me, so I fouled him. Have I played against Steph Curry? No, I have not. He asked that I vote for the Oklahoma State or the Cavaliers. I always vote for the Pelicans, but since I grew up in Oakland, Golden State's the hometown. No.
championship, not as a player, but when I worked for the San Antonio Spurs, so I do have a championship ring. Right. I still play a little bit every once in a while. Yes, I shoot three. I did play against Steve Kerr. He's a really good shooter. Now, I have a question for you guys. What is one thing I said today that you can control? Planning. And what did I also say? What is the most important thing? What is the one? Preparation. And preparation means you're getting ready, you're preparing yourself. That's the one thing you can control. What year did I play the NBA? I played the NBA from 94 to 97. Okay, I want to thank you guys for allowing me to come speak to you guys today. I see a lot of potential in this room. And the thing I want to tell you guys is believe in yourself, pursue your dreams, have a plan, go back to the plan. But the most important thing is you have to believe in yourself. Thank you so much.